Jake talking animation. Cartoon Curious. TV shows, movies, any kind of creation. Cartoon Curious. Don't touch that dial, don't change that station. Cartoon Curious. This is the very best podcast in the nation. Hey everybody, it's been a while since I've done a pickup video. I might show stuff I've already shown since it's been so long, I can't remember. But I'll start with some uh, videos here. Got the Angry Beavers uh, complete series. I remember watching this all the time when it first came out, but I barely remember it now, so I wanted to rewatch this. I also picked up the Super Mario Brothers Super Show, the two sets put out by Shout Factory, but Jake has them, he's borrowing them, so I can't show it, but I did pick up that, and speaking of that, that was the last podcast, uh, the Cartoon Curious podcast was about that, the show, the Super Mario Brothers Super Show, so if you haven't listened, give that a check out. I'll show the Blu-rays now, I picked up Birdman, slipcover, Grand Budapest Hotel, also haven't launched it. Gone Girl, also haven't watched it, um, Ghostbusters 1 and 2, uh, it was cheaper to actually get this than it was to get 2 by itself, because I have 1 on, in Steelbook, Fury, and Random Buy, I picked up The Protector 2, I was talking to JR, and he said it was garbage. And I was going to watch it one night, and then I didn't feel like watching it after hearing that. But I have to sit down and watch it. But he didn't like it, and he likes a lot of garbage. So for him to call it garbage is saying something. Got a random action figure. Uh, Toys R Us is pretty much eliminating their action figures. It's like a tiny little section now stuffed back in the corner. It gets smaller every time I go. But I picked up Alien. Um... Kane figure with the, the mask, with the hole in it, and the face hugger. Comic books picked up an old Daffy Duck Twilight Zone number one here. I believe this came in uh, one of those horror blocks. You got the X File Conspiracy Ninja Turtle issue, Ghostbusters Ninja Turtles number two. Spheres X file with Ghostbusters and the one with the Transformers. And here's a loot crate Batman. Got this at a little thrift store for 50 cents. So I thought he was cool looking. Pumpkin head there. It used to be a nightlight. There's no, it didn't have that in there, but that'd be easy to get if I really wanted a nightlight. But <laughs> I just thought he was neat looking. Bart Simpson's Treehouse of Horror, Spine Tingling, Spooktacular book. And I got some two old uh, Mad Readers here. Let me see, I believe this is 1958. And then Three Ring Mad. This is from 1977. And I got some vinyl here. I picked up Streets of Fire. Um, I could dream about you, a little single, 45. Picked up Jack White's latest album. I showed this one in my last update, but I wanted to show it again because it's awesome. Trick or Treat soundtrack. Uh, these, the rest of these are uh, ones Jake gave me. Um, this one's called White Boys. It's from the 80s, I believe, 1988. White Boys on a Mission. It came from a radio station. That's what this is. But on the bottom here, it says, uh, 41888. This is some of the worst rap I've ever heard. There you go. Three cool white guys rapping. And then he gave me a bunch of vinyl soundtracks. So we got Rocky. Another Stone, a little Paradise Alley. Rocky Three. White Knights. You get Star Wars. Especially priced to this record set. 
One without a case, uh, Batman Mystery of Scarecrow's Corpse, and Gorilla City. These are from 1976. Candy, Stuntman, and Easy Rider. Next to um, the local Goodwill ended up getting a bunch of uh, laser discs from Middlebury College. Most didn't have cases, they were just the disc and plastic sleeves. I passed on most of them. But I did get two, and they were a dollar a piece. Got the Road Warrior laser disc, and a Barton Fink laser disc. Got John Goodman. Those are my random pickups from quite a few months now, probably. I haven't been keeping up with it like I should, but thanks for watching.